I try my best just to get away, but you pulled me closer. You're something wild I can never tame, and you're taking over. All my thoughts and the words I say never seem to matter. You're the love running through my veins, and the crash right Greetings, everyone, with Eddie Olchek, Ray Ferraro coming up in a moment. I'm Mike Emmerich, and we've gotten to game five, and the series is even, and you're coaching the home team, and what are your thoughts? Well, I think first off, Doc, we knew this was going to be a long series, and now it becomes a best of three, and I think if you're the coach of the home team, you're telling your players, look, we've earned this opportunity to have all mice. It's a best of three. Let's not worry about what's going to happen in game five, but let's just worry about the first period. Make sure we get off to a real good start and get our crowd in behind us as well. Wilkes-Barre Scranton still in a driver's seat, Doc. With home ice here tonight, they have a chance to take a strong hold of this series. One way to get off to a good start, get the puck in early, get your legs into it, and don't be afraid to put a body on somebody. We direct our attention to the Nets and the starting goalies. He's the netminder of the evening. He is the type of goalie that sees the puck very well, hoping to see and stop most of the shots he sees tonight and land the W for the Penguins. Bear is the starter again tonight. He plays really large in the net, doesn't give the opponent much to shoot at, hoping to come up big for the visitors. We have a thrilling evening of hockey ahead. I'm Mike Emmerich with Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro. This playoff game has started. Good quick poke check there. The Thunderbirds up the wing lug the puck. And he skates it back to regroup. He's got it. He's got it. Perfect pass. Cut the ice in half. Flings it. Terrific glove save. And a whistle. Play is stopped, and so we have a chance to hear from Ray Ferrari. There's not very many games you can put in the win column if your special teams aren't very good. You have to at least be able to play even most nights with the other team on the power play and penalty kill if you expect to win. Always appreciate hearing what's going on down there, Ray. Freezes play. Possession established. Good reach there. Nice standing poke check by Ruido. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's in possession now as they move up the wing. Got his stick on it. It's on his tape. What a marvelous pass through the center of the ice. Shot. Oh, what a terrific save in close. A quick developing play right in front. Almost looks like he's too close to the goaltender. Puck is thrown to Sestito. Let's it go. And that one turned aside. Goaltender pass. Brought ahead. Scooped up. A shot. Got a piece of it. Got it on his stick in the slot. Oh, what a save. He brought his best shot, and it got stopped. Thankfully, a whistle, Doc. You can take a breath. What a save, and they needed that to take the pressure off. I don't know how the shooter can do much more than that. The goaltender made an excellent save on a great bid for goal. A little under six minutes have elapsed here in the first. We are deadlocked at zero. Nice face-off work. Springfield's moving to center. Into the attacking end. Good centering pass to the slot. Punched away. Trying to go to Erickson. Pitching it to Porter. Now it's directed to Sheary. The Thunderbirds with possession in their own end. Propelled to Thompson. Brings a shot. Marvelous save. No time on that one. You don't get many better opportunities than that. Great save.
Wilkes-Barre Scranton's prevailed on another faceoff. The Penguins have control of the puck at center ice. Nice job, straight stand-up poke check. Shot on. Just got it at the last moment. That one's off the crossbar. We have a winner. Two sticks together, it goes to the offense. Oh, that's more than your normal rub out. Sometimes you just run out of real estate, nowhere to go when he had to take the big hit. Knocks it away with the stick. Looking for options along the side. Drill, wonderful save. Puck covered, whistle blown. Defensive zone win. The Thunderbirds are moving the puck in the defensive zone. Gains the blue line. Superb defensive play by Wilson. Taken toward the neutral zone. And he steps in. A shot. That's a marvelous save. Uh, with this puck being so close to that, this is all a reactionary save. The Thunderbirds are not concerned about their goaltending. A couple of real good stops, but none better than that. What a save early in this game. Quick work on the faceoff. Off his glove! Gathered up again by Jeffrey. Looks ahead to start something. Good work with the stick. Gets in, and he'll look over his options. And the puck control by Sestito. Back in the defensive zone towards center ice. Shot! Big point blank save there. Springfield's lugging it through the center ice area. Good defensive play. Possession changes. Pitch back in to the corner. Carried from the defensive zone. The Thunderbirds wheel one ahead up the wing. Broken stick couldn't take it. Sometimes when you break your stick like that, you get too much ice instead of the puck. He gains the zone. Drill. That hits somebody. Terrific save with a pad. Springfield's in their own end, setting things up. Has it back deep. Intercepted pass. Wonderful chance was set up, and the pass just goes wide. He's pinned and held at the boards. And possession has changed. Brilliant move on that pass. Takes the shot. Gone away. A cover and play is stopped. The Penguins prevailing on the faceoff. Not through. Tries to get it on net. Outstanding glove save. And he'll cover. The Penguins get the draw. Hammers one. Oh, and that shot is way off. Oh, you miss an opportunity like that. You better not be in a hurry to get back to that bench. Hung right over him and couldn't get it past. Seems like he was in too tight on the goaltender. The Thunderbirds continue to probe up the wing. Has it in his own end. Carries it up the wing. Fires! Outstanding stop! First 20 minutes are finished here. We are scoreless. The goalies were strong. Are you ready for a walk down memory lane? Then it's time to sign up for our fantasy camp. Play hockey with childhood heroes. It's a fun-filled week full of memories. The Penguins are resting at the end of the period in a tie game. But what might have been a lead denied by the post. We'll be right back. Opening faceoff for period two. Nothing, nothing. Pointed to Ruido. Lightning in that glove. 
play is stopped. There is a signal. We just wanted to see who it is he's taking off. Springfield's two minute penalty is for cross checking. You want to see a cross check? Look at the player's hands and positioning on his stick. And so begins power play number one. Let's see if it's power play goal number one. Good job on that face off, tying the man up. And that one sent back out to see. And at an angle to Sheary. They must retreat and start back again. Snapping a pass to Sheary. Can he make him chase it? No, oh, they got it out. They check the clock and prepare to defend some more. Perfect pass. And they are in. Gives it over to the point. Routine play done well still time on this power play but not much the Thunderbirds have killed it off and it's a good pickup good job with the stick the Thunderbirds lock that along through the neutral zone to the point it comes great stick work terrific save terrific opportunity you talk about cutting down the angle. Perfectly executed by the goaltender. Into the end of attack. Save! Got that pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. Pad save! Solid pad save. Waits with it. Let He beat everything but the post! Good opportunity to regroup here after that save, but now they got to win a defensive zone faceoff. Barra's able to make the stop here on a very difficult scoring chance. Just a hair over five minutes played here in the second. It is tied at Cobb. The Penguins win it. Wonderful save on a terrific scoring chance. The Penguins with possession up the wing. Got it right back. He is shut right off. Oh, he's been looking for that hit all night. Wow, what a glove save. What a glove save. He showed him the glove and he took it away. Beat him on that one. Big drive. You can almost count that one, but no, what a save. A hammer shot from the point. Springfield's looking to head man up the wing. Breakaway! Wonderful save! Near the boards. Gains the zone. Good shooting place. He covers and holds on. Tie up and help from the winger. The Thunderbirds control the play in the defensive zone. Moves up along the boards. A terrific job on the cut pass. Tripped up on the play, and there will be a penalty. And we get a penalty. Referee to the table, a player to the box. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's given a minor here for tripping. Well, in desperation mode, all he was trying to do was sweep the puck away, but unfortunately caught the player's skates. There's always a start to your power play night, and this is number one. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's got a defensive zone win. The Penguins control the play at center. Carried toward the neutral zone. The poke check worked. And possession established on the pickup by Porter. He's in on an onside play. He's alone. Great save. Looking from the blue line. Turned a shot on net. Blocked. He is slashed, and there'll be a penalty for that. Springfield's got two minutes on their penalty total, and this one's for slashing. 
Oh, look at the reaction of the puck carrier. He is in some pain. That's a slash. Puck about to be put in play with both teams short one player. Springfield penalty to number 15. Off the faceoff, he ties his man up, and so the puck goes to his team. Onside. The Penguins have killed off the penalty. Now they go to the power play. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's controlling the play in the defensive zone. He throws it there. Terrific save. Cleared back along and out of harm's way. The power play unit has to recoil and try yet again. And in flight over the line. Let's it go. Outstanding save with a glove. That was all positioning right into his glove. Strong play on that faceoff. You have to be strong to hold that other guy off. Nap by Ruido. Directing that one to Dupuy. The Thunderbirds are back even. Hammered. Save. Terrific interception. The Thunderbirds luck that along up the wing. Got it in his own end. On to Thompson. Maintaining possession up the wing. Good intercept. On that interception, might turn into something. Good poke check by Dupuis. Pass cut. Blue line control. He scores! We've got a score in the game other than 0-0 zero, zero now. Thompson's wrist shot was heavy and quick. That's the shot there, Edzo. Low to the stick side. The goaltender can't get to it. The Thunderbirds have scored here late in the second period, and it's the first goal of the game. It comes from the sticks that haven't been too active. The Penguins with a win at center. Slides it to the point to Sestito. Looking to Headman up the wing. Looking to Belisi. Gets in. What'll he do? Jabbed away by Ruido. The Penguins carrying on in their own end. Got that pass up the same side of the ice. And he picks it up. Two sticks together, they cancel. Around through the corner. Side to side they go, trying to generate something. Waffle boarded. Great save at the edge of the crease. Not a lot of room to score from in that area. Great save. In the second period. Into the marvelous save. A great chance was no chance. Gets in, looks over his options here. Chip to Porter. What a ripper! Good standing poke check. We've played two periods here of a three-period game. The best part of the day is coming up. Are you looking for information on the stars of tomorrow today? Check out page 21 of the program or our website for profiles on Farm. Thompson's goal came late in the period, and that has meant the difference so far. Intermission is here. Third period about to begin. The rear view mirror will help us with the first two, and so will Edzo. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's got a real tough task ahead of him as we get ready for the third period. They know they're facing a hot goaltender. They know they've created a lot of chances. They need a bounce. They need to get a greasy goal. In order to do that, you've got to put yourself right in front of the goaltender. Picked up in the attacking zone. You could almost count that one, but no. Springfield's only going to get two minutes on this call, but it was tripping. He's got great stick positioning. Stick is on the ice, but unfortunately takes the skates out from under him. 
They've moved the puck around beautifully on a power play. Just nothing to show for it. I sure agree, Eddie. We're expecting that to happen here. Let's see if it does. It's cleared back, and this forces a recoil. The Penguins' power play will reset. Pitching this one to Jeffrey. Moving it to Sheary. Pass cut, strong play. They shot it back down. Now they can get ready for another rush. The Penguins with possession in the defensive zone. Takes a perfect pass, but that's what your wings are for. They give it to you right in the center. Oh, that was close. A chance to clear. And he gets it out. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's got time for only this rush. Took that wrist shot. Oh, stick save. Springfield's done it. Back at full strength. It's an onside play. He knifed it away. Wanting to generate something up the wing. Pass attempt to Horvath. The Thunderbirds have it up the wing. Decides he wants the corner. Slid to Thompson. That shot came from nowhere. A missed opportunity from this close in. The Penguins continue on in their own end. And a bomb to Jeffrey. Shoots one. Foot covered, whistle blown. Thompson's among the highest goal scorers in the league. He does his damage from in close to the net. He'll power his way in looking for rebounds. He's got a real knack for where the loose puck is. The Thunderbirds through the neutral zone controlling the play. And they've got it again. Back near the blue line to Pardee. In the slot. Great opportunity, but the pass didn't connect. Passing one off now to Erickson. Puck is thrown to Party. He's got that pass off the right wing and can move ahead. It all alone. And he got that one. The Penguins wheel it up the wing. Ooh, what a break. Shot hit the man. Through the neutral zone, skating with it now. Jabbed away by Wilson. Good grab again. Oh, wonderful play. Shot down for an icing. They are overwhelmed, and I guess they thought that was the best thing. The shot's delivered quickly, but he smothers the bottom of the net so well, gets his legs out to make the stop. Just a little under nine minutes gone in this period. The Thunderbirds ahead, 1-0. Springfield's got it again. Great job on a cut pass. Nicely into the zone. Let's it go. Big pad save. Oh, what a play. Gauntz is tripped up. That should be a penalty. Off his helmet mask. Play is stopped, and now we'll hear the call. The Thunderbirds have been handed a minor penalty for tripping. This is an easy call for the official, Doc. The player made no attempt to play the puck and just tripped up the attacking player. There is hope with every man advantage, even if your percentage is poor. Are you listening? Tie up there and a good reach and possession. Trying to go to party. That was a great job. Shot back down. More time off the clock. The Penguins control the play in their own end. Pitching it to Sheary. Gains the zone. And he fires. Oh, my. That one was way wide. They did everything right there except hit the net. Flings it. A lightning light glove save. That's one way to stop the momentum. Cover the puck and get a whistle. We go down to the benches. It's Ray Ferraro. Bear has been an absolute rock and goal for his club. He's been so solid, they've been able to relax and play with an aggressiveness up front. A spectacular performance for him, Ray. Eddie and I have talked in the intermission about how we can think of at least three or four that are going to wind up on a highlight reel. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's got another win. Score! And this one is tied! Boy, he hit that puck square in the middle of his stick.
stick. Great technique. He must have lost his angle here, Enzo. This puck beats him pretty cleanly up into the blocker side, into the top of the net. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's goal has tied this game up. A fun ride to the finish for all of us now. Face-off win, and now what will they do with it? Laid on to Ruido. Let's the shot fly. The shot is off. Snaps one in there. Score! Two straight goals. The shooter had a couple of different options here. He could pass or shoot. He decided on the ladder and beat the goaltender clean. Barra's probably pretty happy with his positioning here, Edzo, but he's beaten over the glove. The Penguins have broken the tie here in the third period. A wonderful ride to the finish for all of us now. Neutralized faceoff win. Fires, and it's driven away again. Snapping a pass to Belissi. Moved along and in. That's a good solid poke check. Fantastic shutdown. The Penguins want to generate something up the wing. Hammer, blockered away. Knocked right off the stick. Takes that on his stick and looks ahead. And he's tripped and there'll be a penalty. A penalty has been called and the game could hinge on this. The Penguins are going to the box for two minutes, and the call is tripping. No, oh, this is a tough call. He was trying to play the puck, but he tripped up the attacking player. Springfield's power play gets another chance to operate. Hasn't been effective yet. A big win. Let's see what happens. Say. Oh, there's a little bit of a luck involved there. The goalie was screened on a play. He couldn't see it. But he stopped it. Let's it go. Terrific glove save. Shoots. Cut his glove on it. And now it's directed to Porter. Flips that wrist shot. Got a piece of it with the glove. Pointed to Erickson. Oh, deflected away. He recoils back and hopes for better. The Penguins controlling play now in their own end. Directing that one to Erickson. Magnificent breakup of the odd man rush. Still some time. The Penguins with a big penalty kill. Good save there. Springfield's been outplayed for most of this night, but their goaltender has kept them in it. He's been exceptional throughout. And the pickup. The Penguins have it in center ice. Slid just inside the line to Porter. Just wide of the post. Good save there. Guarded the goal again. We are in the last minute of play, and we're almost ashamed to say it's over. A wonderful shot answered quickly. Terrific stop from right in front of the net, but you've got to find a way to put the puck in the net. Looking to Sestito. Gets across, looks over his options. Gloved. He covers, and a face-off will follow. Springfield's been an offensive juggernaut led by this player who has among the highest points totals in the league. He's a dangerous player, remarkably skilled on the power play. Point to point to point. Perfect connection right through center. Pitching this one to Akalazzi. There he goes, net empty. Let's take a chance here, they're saying. Propelled to Horva. Headed right down the middle under the scoreboard. Net open, score! game tonight after that empty netter. I'll probably put a bowl on this one, Enzo. That'll be it. The 
Penguins got that faceoff win. Now what? Let's it go. Lock that. On to Sutter. Solid neutralized poke check. And the horn is sounded, and this one goes down into the books. The Penguins come away victorious in a close contest. They had the puck the majority of the evening. They should have won by a much greater margin. Tournaments are fun, especially when they get to loser goes home, winner moves on. We are at that point. Don't miss our next one. For Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, Mike Emmerich saying so long for now.